importante che tu mantenga. I think I'm really lucky that I can ride motorcycle because for me racing is fun. The Italian fans are really warm and uh, they, they, they want you to win. So it's not easy, but uh, this is how it goes and uh, I love it. He burst off the scene in 03, 04. Since his move to MX1 in 2009, he's been pretty much dominant. I twist my knee on the first moto. Hopefully it's nothing too bad. I tried to do good on the second race, and, uh, but I had some pain on the knee and I, I was careful in the first laps. I lose some position and then uh, I come back to the end. Over overall it's okay. The championship is, uh, is going well. I like to cook. I think it's, uh, you know, in Italy, it we are uh, known also for a good food, so like lunch or dinner with the family, there is always 20 people or 15 people. And when you grow up like this, it's uh, it's easy to, to start loving the food. Finish! I always like riding with road bikes, rally cars, jet ski when it's possible. We say in Italy, bella vita. The bella vita is like a, everybody loves to search for, uh, for fun uh, all the time. Tony is like the same guy during the week and then the races. Like two minutes before the start, he's even laughing, making jokes with his mechanic. I know Jill already pretty long and uh, she's always behind me. And that's what I really appreciate it. Uh, I always think it's not easy for her, I mean, but she likes it. It's cool to have uh, such a girl around you. Going around, around Rome, for me, it's one of the best cities in the world. I always think about the history. When I pass by these old monuments with my scooter, I like to, to think what, what can happen here uh, so many years ago, and uh, I think uh, I, I wouldn't change it with any city. I think I can improve still on my riding skills. Like today, it was pretty hard pack, and I really don't feel so comfortable on it, so I, uh, I have to work a little bit on the, a little bit on the hard pack track. My goal is to bring home another title. This is my main goal, but to enjoy my riding. It's his life. But he has so much fun in what he's doing that he never see it as work. And a good jump for Kai Rowley, but also is that uh, Gonsalves from yeah. uh, about eight or nine gates over. And it's him that pulls the whole shot, monos his way through the first couple. And the Ice One Racing KTM rider, he leads the way going through turn two. Cody Cairoli already alongside him though. Cairoli takes over the lead. I think he did great. The public enjoyed the race. And I'm happy. I'm all happy. I'm all happy. Once again, it's going to be MX1 race one. Tony Cairoli leads the championship by a massive 82 points. So Tony Cairoli who won the Qatar, two races in Thailand, one in the Netherlands, and a winner in moto number two last week in Latvia. He wins race one here in Finland. And welcome to the 2013 British Motocross Grand Prix. Will we see history made here? And Tony Cairoli take his fifth straight MX1 title to add to the two MX2s he's already got. There's the five second ball. The gate's gonna drop any second now. Away they go, into turn one, round turn one they go. Cairoli, it's Cairoli to Sal, Clement to Sal, Cairoli. How clever was that, Cairoli just cut a much tighter line, now he'll do the same, he'll swap back on the inside and get some drive going over the tabletop, Cairoli's right on the back wheel of the Sal, into the tight turn and they almost touch, Cairoli not quite gets the drive, but the move is coming to Sal knows he's there. Ladies and gentlemen, please celebrate your new world champion, Antonio Cairoli. It's his seventh 
title now and you're so proud of him that he do it every year again and again and then seeing all the people around him the same people for the last 10 years that are working so hard how it can be more emotional but it get more emotional every time Tony, how does it feel, mate? Ah, amazing, you know. My goal was not just to finish on points. My goal was to win uh, the first moto and, uh, and get the title on the best way. So it works and I'm really happy about it. And uh, now let's make some fun and uh, some parties and uh, enjoy this time. Good job, dude.